Hey, welcome back to The Wasteland, partner. We continue playing Fallout New Vegas. I'm your host, Rosary. And we got our next lead. We are headed to Nipton to try to find out who attempted to unalive us. I keep thinking some of these plants are people. Is this the town? Something pit stop, okay. Oh, there's a bunch of them. I mean, clearly this is an ambush. Look at you, you don't even have any armor on, just jeans and a t-shirt. Well, shit. So we've got their little ambush set up, but this time they're already out and they're wise to my shenanigans. Health go back up. It looked like she was down to like one or two bars left. Or am I just missing everything? That was gorgeous. Ah! Finally figured out the hot keys. I'm out! Alright, what else I got? Uh, it's revolver time. Oh yeah, of course, to... No, not this guy! Oh goodness! I'm out of bullets for this one too now! Dagnabbit! What do I got? Why does it say I have bullets? I equip it and it says two and O. Oh, so I have two bullets. By the skin of my teeth. Wow. 10 millimeter pistol. See that? I was wondering about that because I remember them being 10 millimeters and not nine. I don't know if I have any more ammo for you. I guess it only really takes one well-placed shot. I knew there was more of you. All that for basically nothing. That food and drink catch up. We'll equip the 10 millimeter pistol now because I actually have ammo for that. And next to nothing else. Oh god, who the hell's shooting at me now? I don't have the ammo or the health for this.
Or maybe they're not even shooting at me. Now I am at this moment inclined to not insert myself into the affairs of others. Alright, so this is the beautiful town that I've been looking for. I think that was a plant. Smell that air! Couldn't you just drink it like booze? <laughs> what? Are, are you okay, friend? Are you kidding me? Never felt better! Yeah! Somehow sort of doubt that. What kind of lottery did you win? Because it was not the genetic one. What lottery? The lottery! That's what lottery! Are you stupid? Only lottery that matters! Oh, oh my god! Smell that air! <laughs> Are you a Power Ranger? Powder Ganger? What? I mean, yeah, used to be, sure. But not no more. Powder Gang is small time, man. I'm a winner! I won the motherfucking lottery! <laughs> I need to get going. Bye. That was... Oh. This is a friendly little town. That's an interesting exchange. What am I doing here? I am here to find out information about who tried to kill me. What is it this time? What, what do you mean? I just met you. Why are you still here? I don't know. I just love it here. What the fuck do you think, asshole? Hey, well, calm down. The place was I got to live, but they beat my fucking legs with hammers. I'm fucking crippled, get it? That <laughs> sucks for you. I don't have any medics for you. I might have some, but I'm not letting him have any. Bullshit. You're holding. You just want it all for yourself. How did you survive? Luck. That's how. I'm just that fucking lucky. You're looking at the second place winner of the Nipton Lottery. That asshole Swanick took first place. So him they let walk. What? Tell me about this lottery. It ain't like we came to Nipton to play it. Me and my crew had it worked out to kidnap some NCR troopers who come to town to get laid. Had it all worked out with the scumbag mayor. We were going to ransom them off, keep their weapons for ourselves. A nice score. Uh, it's a beautiful plan. How'd you fuck it up? We get in position, and next thing we know, we're surrounded by those fucking Legion freaks. They dragged us and everybody else into the center of town. And that asshole with a dog on his head, he starts talking about how we're bad people. He said we needed to be punished for what we did. Not all of us, but some of us. And then he gives everyone a fucking lottery ticket. What happened to everyone who got the lottery tickets? What do you think? He started drawing tickets and that's how people got punished. First up was the lucky losers. They got decapitated. Guess that's lucky cause it's pretty quick. Then came the crucifixions. God damn, but those went on and on and on. Third place runners up got enslaved. I got the fuck beat out of my legs and the winner, they let go free. I mean, admittedly, that sucks, but you kind of got a better deal than a lot of them. What happened to the mayor? Him? When his ticket came up, they burned him alive on a pile of tires. Wow. You said some people were enslaved? Yeah. A bunch of those Legion fucks dragged them off right away. They were headed east, if you're feeling heroic. Not my problem. That's how I figure it. Got problems of my own to handle. So, um, back up here. Am I supposed to know who this is? He's talking to me like we have a history together. Was this the guy who sold me out for the job on the delivery board? And I'm really bad with names. <laughs> Uh, what else you got to talk about? 
I guess nothing really. Bye. Got an empty fridge. Uh, some kind of locked door that's easy. We'll, we'll try it. Nice. What do we got in here? Did you see that? That crazy bitch just attacked me out of nowhere. Uh, I don't like this. Alone in a stairwell with a strange man. Any idea why? No, none at all. We've been traveling together since I picked her up a few days ago. And she's been friendly this whole time. We'd actually been flirting a little when she suddenly pulled a gun out and began yelling at me to hand my caps over. Now that I think of it, though, she laughed when I threw her my money. I think what she really wanted was my Lucky Charm necklace. You, you think she was after your shillelagh? Uh, Lucky Charm necklace? You don't say. Yeah, every once in a while you can find a cap with a blue star on it. They're pretty rare, so I started collecting them. Once I had enough, I made a necklace out of them, since I thought they were lucky. Oh, this is the Sunset Sarsaparilla caps. Just, just be more careful in the future, all right? I You're will. sweet kid. That's the last time I pick up a straggler on the road, believe me. I don't think I have any DLC for this game, so I don't know if this is part of like the main story where people just accost you and tell you about the Willy Wonka bottle cap thing. Who just leaves their safe unlocked? That's just bad business practice. I can't see shit in here. Well, someone had their dirty little apartment upstairs. Good for them that they just let me rummage through it. It's this guy. And... All right, does that satisfy my quest for information or am I have to entanglement into this town's quarrel? So I'm heading to Novak through Nipton, which is. a bit further on, so I may not actually have to deal with all this bullshit. Cause I don't know, as a single lady in the post-apocalypse, this doesn't feel very welcoming, if you know what I mean. Once again, that's me role-playing as Bottle Cap Becky. A unique character that my community helped me pick. But yeah, I'm just gonna keep moseying on. I think trains actually run in this place. Would not surprise me to train hasn't been through in 200 years. I step on the tracks and whammo! ourselves a little valley here, some ominous music. Is that like a traffic cone? Turned over bus. Maybe some goodies in here? Hell yeah. What else we got? Wait, is that full or empty? Empty. I absolutely love it when the physics are all janky and you barely like touch one thing and everything just starts like jiggling. Ah! 
the fuck? Damn, did any of those connect? I'm starting to just collect a bunch of extra guns because as the condition wears down, it's like I just toss one out and pick up the next one. Ooh, that was a nice critical strike. pretty weak trap but keeps the the pace going keeps the momentum up so i don't know if i mentioned it but i discovered there is a way to put your gun away you hold square well it's square for me it's it keeps labeling everything as xbox controls but i can't think of a controller without thinking of the playstation variety uh, also, am able to um, keybind some stuff to the arrows. So I've got one. I don't know what up does, but I have the the nine millimeter coming out with right, and then I have um, stim packs on down, which I'm out of stim packs at the moment. So Nipton, I think, is where we're headed. don't know if being out at night is any more or less dangerous than during the day, but look at these two assholes. Look, if you're having like a like a little tryst, like oh, they don't seem angry. Hello. Alright. True to Kaiser. Okay, then. Just, just two cute little boys having a little makeout session behind a sign. Like, nothing wrong with that. That is a lot of gunfire. Doesn't seem to be hitting me. And it doesn't seem to be in the direction I want to go, so. Uh, I can't see what's going on over there. Traveling at night does kind of suck because it's really hard to see. Still doesn't seem to be trying to involve me. Hopefully it's just people firing on some critters. That was a weird sound. Like a quick millisecond of a creature breathing and then it just went away.
that is the direction I want to be heading. I'm still trying to two-step around this giant mountain. Cactus scared me. I thought it was a person. Couple rounds left in this gun. Seems like I might have picked up some 9mm rounds, so let's try it. Let's give this bad boy a try. How far back is this gonna put me? You know, on second thought, I think I will see what uh, this Quasar business is all about. Finding out that I am extremely under leveled to be wandering around the wasteland and I really need some supplies. Don't worry, I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you happen by. I want you to witness the fate of the town of Nipton, to memorize every detail. And then, when you move on, I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson that Kaisar's Legion taught here, especially any NCR troops you run across. I might be able to give some broad strokes, but I don't know about memorizing shit. Uh, what lessons did you teach here? Where to begin? That they are weak and we are strong, this much was known already. But the depths of their moral sickness, their dissolution, Nipton serves as the perfect object lesson. What do you mean exactly? Nipton was a wicked place, debased and corrupt. It served all comers, so long as they paid. Profligate troops, powder gangers, men of the Legion, such as myself. The people here didn't care. It was a town of whores. Oh, goodness me. The town agreed to lead those it had sheltered into a trap. Only when I sprang it did they realize they were caught inside it, too. Town of whores, you say? You captured everyone? Yes, and herded them to the center of town. I told them their sins, the foremost being disloyalty. I told them that when legionaries are disloyal, some are punished. The others made to watch. And I announced the lottery. Each clutched his ticket, hoping it would set him free. Each did nothing, even when loved ones were dragged away to be killed. You, you slaughtered the innocent civilians? Ha! <laughs> innocent? Hardly. Cowardly, though. They outnumbered us, yet not once did they try to resist. They stood and watched as their fellows were butchered, crucified, and burned, one by one. They stood and hoped their turn would not come. Each cared only for himself. I, I guess I'll do what you say, man. I'll, I'll uh, spread the rumors. Then I bid you, Wale, until we meet again. All right, cool. So we're on... Good terms with the furry leader of this town. Now, if only I could find someone I can trade with. Did 
Doesn't seem to be a whole lot going on in here. Oh, this dude died on the shitter. Poor guy. I've had some poops where I thought I was going to die, but luckily I made it through. What the hell is growling? Is there a bear in here? I thought we were cool! to shoot the dog? That's a bad boy. Down, doggy. There's not treats in my pocket. Ah! Holy shit, there's so many of them. Get the fuck out of here. I mean, it really seems like the town's been, like, burned to the ground and everyone killed except for old Cripple Legs and the one that won the lottery. I don't know if I'm really going to gain anything here. Damn it, I didn't want the plate, I wanted the maze. Ham radio? Is that the one the truckers use? No, that's CB. What's ham radio? Is that how you order ham? Breaker Breaker 1-9, I got a mad hankering for some pork sirloin. Ready to die for your country, you commie son of a bitch! What the fuck?! Run. What's with the intense music? <laughs> I can sleep here. They'll probably be like, you can't sleep here. There's enemies nearby. Oh, they weren't even done with their dinner. They got all murked. Just waiting around a second to let the food kick in. Ah! Every day is a good day to die. I mean, I agree with you, but... I don't want mine to be today. So it really seems like this is not a good place to find supplies or shelter or health items or anything really. So I'm just going to get the fuck up out of here. Well, folks, I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, you've already seen me make this travel, so I'm going to cut to the far side of this trail, see where it leads. And, uh, yeah, be sure to check back next week as I continue playing Fallout New Vegas. <laughs> this, this wacky, wacky story, man. I don't know where it's going to take me next. Thank you for watching to the end of the video. If you enjoyed what you saw, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. Doing so encourages YouTube to show my content to more people. 
and you won't want to miss out on my next upload.